As you build your comps in After Effects, you're going to slowly but surely find that you're bringing in tons of images and audio files and movie files and even RLA or RPF files, JPEGs, PNGs, and so on. After a while, you're going to lose track of what's going on, so you're going to have to rely on folders to help you out. So let me show you how you can create folders and also bring stuff in by dragging a folder directly into the interface. So as you can see here, I have a couple of different things here. If you look under the type here, I have JPEGs, PNG, QuickTime Movie, and a couple of other files here. So what I can do is go down here to this little folder icon, or I can go to File, New, Folder, which is of course the long way, but you know me, I like to show you both ways, and you can name these whatever you want to. So I'll call this one RPFs, and then I'll simply click on the first RPF, I'll hold down my shift key to grab the last one, and then I'll click on any of them and drag it right into that folder. I'll create another folder, and we'll call this one JPEGs. And you don't have to use caps, you can call it whatever you want. And you do the same thing, drag your JPEGs right on in there. And we can do one for movies as well, so I'll just make this one lowercase. We'll call this moves and we'll drag that movie in there and last but not least we have a PNG so once again PNGs you can do this for anything that you're working on by the way so you know if you could put subject matter animal movies or people movies nature just have fun creating the fold that you need you can also by the way click on this little yellow guy here and create a label color for example so for images, let's say I have JPEGs, I have PNGs and RPFs, I can click on this and let's say I want to give all my images an aqua color. All right, so I'll go ahead and give this one aqua as well. And that one. And movies I'll make, let's see, peach. This is a great way to quickly at a glance see what's what. So you don't have to necessarily read these. You can go right ahead to the label and see what's going on. And as you can see here, by clicking on this little label tag, I'm able to sort those right away. So by going to type, I can rearrange these by type. I click on the word name and I can rearrange things on the name basis, size, duration, or whatever. But when I want to label everything in a nice, neat label way, click on that. All right, one last trick I want to show you is that on my desktop, I have a folder called pics. And there's really not much in here. But if you do want to bring content into After Effects, you can do it the same way. You can go click and drag it right on in the project panel and then whatever's inside of that folder now appears so that's a quick way for you to bring content in as well now we talked about how to create folders how do we get rid of folders and how do we continue to work with these well I can take this folder for example and click on the garbage can now the good thing about this After Effects is smart enough to realize that there is something inside of that folder that you might not actually want to get rid of. And it's going to say, hi man, I'm your friend. Are you sure you want to delete this because there's something in there? And if you're sure, hit delete. If not, simply twirl it open by clicking on this little icon and just drag this guy right on out to the top of the stack like so. And then you can go ahead and get rid of that folder. So that is how you can get rid of things. And if it's not in a folder, you won't even be asked that question. So that is how you can create folders, delete folders, and give them labels inside of After Effects.